All right. Well, good morning, everyone, and happy afternoon to others. It is February 21st, our Tuesday morning, and uh, I say 2016 here on my on my screen, but it's not 2016. It is 2017. Uh, welcome to our webinar for our Inform uh, coaches, and we're glad you guys are here. This is a great time to be able to talk about Inform and get people healthy and strong and moving forward with their lives in a fun and healthy way. So uh, this is Terry Gibson. I'm your host. Uh, working with you live here from Utah, and uh, it's been a blast. I've had a good time here this past couple of weeks and this past weekend, doing some great things in my southern region. And uh, hopefully you all can hear me, and if you can, please just raise your hand over there to the, the right side of the screen. I hope I see a few uh, hands showing up. Oh, there's a few I see there. Awesome, awesome. That is great, great. Glad you can hear my voice. Uh, again, I'm, I'm excited to be on this this webinar with you guys. I'm I'm doing quite a few of these. I like them. They're, they're pretty fun. Uh, but this past weekend, I was doing something a little bit different. I was actually in Richmond, Virginia, and actually I was out there doing a uh, inform, uh, not inform, but a an essential oils training with Ms. Shanaz Nincy. We had a great training group out there, uh, and so people got certified on essential oils. And so that's a that's a fun thing too. If you haven't dove into the essential oils just yet, I I'll make a little plug for that one. That's a good thing to get involved with. The world's kind of changing and turning to that trend of e essential oils, which some of you are probably experts in and have been for a while now. But uh, get certified, have fun with that, and uh, it, it was a good training there for me too. First time in Richmond, Virginia, so that was that was really awesome. But today we have some great things happening with our webinar, and I I love to be able to share with you some fun fun things here. I have a special guest, so if you have. Uh, your questions or comments or anything you want to say to us, there's a little panel over to the right side that says questions. Uh, feel free to jot down your questions, write down some input there, and throughout the course of the webinar, we'll collect those, and toward the end of it, we'll actually answer some of those with our, our expert guests here on the line. Um, but I want you to think about some fun things as you go along and, and really how INFORM has impacted you in your life. Hopefully, you're changing people's lives for the better as you're moving forward, uh, but for yourself as well. This is a, a self-improvement program just as much as it is helping other people. And you guys as coaches know better better than most people out there what's good for your bodies. So uh, with that, I want to be able to give you this thought. I, I used to start off my day with a with an inspirational vitamin, I call it. It's, it's one of those things that kind of gets you spurred. And if you haven't had your inspirational thought for the morning, here's one for you. Uh, here's something from Miss Maya Angelou. She was one of our poet laureates for uh, the country. Do the best you can until you know better. Then when you know better, do better. Very simple phrase, but has a very powerful impact. And I thought about that as we've gone throughout uh, the INFORM idea, the whole getting your body back in health for the new year. Uh, people sometimes only can do as much as they know. But once they know a little bit more, they can do more and hopefully do better. So I'm going to give you that as a thought as we move forward here with some of the things we're discussing about INFORM. Because we're looking at kind of the, the root cause. We're looking at the metabolic syndrome, the metabolic system, and getting that in line and, and moving forward. It is not simply a weight loss program. It is uh, even more than that. I'm not sure if we'd even be accurate in labeling it a weight loss program. It's about moving your, your body and your metabolic system forward. So without any further ado, I want to bring on our special guest. This young lady here uh, has excellent, excellent rapport and and of course, experience in handling with these type of issues, but more or less, she's just a, a good person too. I, I love working with Miss Dale Scott, our uh, our guest trainer for the day. So, Miss Dale, are you there? I am, and Terry Gibson, you are just too good to me. So thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just just speaking the truth here. Just speaking Ma? the truth. So let me see if I can. I'll give you some powers there, so you can actually use the uh, the screen. See if you can use that now in the advancing right. your slides. Okay. Hey, it should let me do that. We'll see what happens here. Um, let me try. We had it working. My mouse is working, so let's just see. Come on, giddy up and go. All right, if you want to just go ahead, I'll just oh, let you advance you. the slide, maybe so. You that did that might. one yourself. It moved right on, so you did okay. it. Okay, all right, perfect, perfect. All right, welcome, and I'm so glad that you're all on here. Thank you for being here. Thank you for letting me have the opportunity to talk about how uh, I've learned to help others, and I'm sure that you're learning how to help others, and many of you already uh, are a godsend to many other people. So, you know, what we send into the lives of others 
is comes back into our own. So one of the things that makes our um, the new metabolic system uh, kit, program, whatever you want to call it, we're going to talk about that here in a minute, but there is something going on out here in the world. And every year, $3 trillion or an average of $9,523 per person is spent on health care. So think about that. How much have you spent on health care this year? We want to see what is causing the devastating trend. So we're going to move to the next slide here. and. Um, You know, Carrie, my computer is very slow. So let's just, if you don't mind, let's just use, if you'll take that back. Yeah, I got and, it. I uh, it. Okay, you. that's nope. wonderful. All right, so what is that dangerous trend that we have out here? So on this slide, I want us to look uh, at the Western diets and the lifestyle changes that have increased, and it's increased the overweight population. So we're looking at BMI. Now we've learned that BMI is not the best way to determine my health. Uh, we have a runner that in our town and he is very fit. BMIs tell him that he uh, has too much fat and he is very muscly. And so, but this is what is out there and that's what is being used. So let's just take a look at the BMI. It shows you a healthy weight. It shows a BMI of 25 to 29.9 is overweight. Moves right on up there into the red zone, dangerously overweight. And then 35. And I'm just going to mention to you, as you, you're going to learn how this program works, we had a lady that worked in the transportation department in a school system. And she was told because of the Kansas law had changed and she was going to lose her job in January if, as a bus driver if she could not get her BMI down and uh, it had to be below 35. And so she joined our group and she started on the INFORM program. And 57 pounds down later and her BMI was in a great healthy range. Uh, we talked once, I had her come and share with other people and um, I asked her, I said, you know, Jeannie, tell us your story. And she said, you know, when I first started, it was about my job. I did not want to lose my job. And then she started crying and she said, but you know, now it's about me. I am so excited to see what I can do and have done and what is better in my life because of the INFORM program. So we'll move forward, Terry, if you don't mind. So we're saying BMI. That's one thing let's just pay attention to. Now the next slide is going to show us something else. This is on the rise. Blood sugar levels. Now it shows you here uh, blood sugar readings. A healthy reading would be 110. Now this is fasting first thing in the morning. And uh, you want it actually below 100. That would be absolutely ideal. Now, if you're a diabetic already, you would love for it to be the 110. You would love for it possibly even to be 125. But this is showing what has happened and how the blood sugar level is on the rise. Now, what I want everybody to understand is you're going to find out why the INFORM program is for everybody. It's for everybody, and it's for everybody. So as we look at this, we have an increased risk of metabolic syndrome, which we'll talk about here in a minute, once our blood sugar of a morning is 110 to 125. So you can buy those meters very inexpensively, so start monitoring it, and then you're going to see how your body will improve. But look at dangerously unhealthy. Now, 126 and above becomes a dangerous threat, becomes a dangerous threat to our system, to our health, and then we'll move on to the cholesterol levels. So what is your LDL uh, cholesterol level? So this gives you kind of a rate, and this is 
uh, what's going on in America, going on worldwide. But in America, we have become a product of our product, and our product happens to be sugar, fats, uh, trans fats, a lot of sugar, a lot of uh, lack of nutrient dense foods. So the the LDL cholesterol level. You want those to be 110 or lower. That's a healthy range. But if it's 100 to 129, that starts to increase, an increased risk of what? Dis-ease. I don't like the word disease. I like the word dis-ease because my body, when it's out of ease, it is dis-ease. So the INFORM is teaching and educating people how to bring it back into ease. But we'll go ahead and look at the other uh, LDL cholesterol levels because this is where many people are, 130 to 159. Now it's starting to increase that risk, and let's scoot right on up, even up to 190. And at that point, many of the people might be on medication or the doctor has already talked to them about medication. And what I like to teach people about the INFORM, it's learning to eat the right foods at the right times for the right reason. So we can move right on to the next slide. And the question is, why are we gaining more weight? Why are we less healthy? Why are we aging more quickly? So those are some questions that uh, when you talk to people, and I just want to mention, you know, be so proud that you are a health coach. A lot of times when people say, what do you do, you stammer and stutter. You're trying to say, well, I'm an informed coach. And then they say, okay, what is that? You know what? You are coaching people. You are encouraging people to have good health. So you are a health coach. And these are questions you can answer, you can let people know, you can share with them, you have the answer why people are gaining more weight. Is INFORM a weight loss program? No. Do people that are overweight, do does their weight balance as they get healthier? Yes. Why are we less healthy? And why are we aging more quickly? So the next slide gives us some ideas. So think of the people that you see walking down the street, just take a look at your surroundings. Take a look at your environment. You've got people that are overweight, sure, but you have people that might not be overweight, but guess what? Their cholesterol levels are not good. You have people that have high sugar levels, and all of this starts to go together. When I'm not as healthy as I was, then my sugar levels may be the beginning point. Then I may notice my blood pressure is up a little. Then if I have a blood test, I see that the cholesterol is not where it needs to be. All of these things lead to metabolic dysfunction. So one in three people suffer from that right now. And remember, $3.5 trillion a year is what is being spent on trying to get rid of it but if you look around, it is not getting rid of it. And we have the answer. So let's move on and see what we can do for that. The INFORM program focuses on the root cause. So remember those questions. You know, why am I gaining weight? Why am I not as healthy? Why am I so tired? So we want to take a look at the root cause. Now, the next slide tells us that nature sunshine has given us proof, OK? we have the proof to back that up. So many companies say, oh, do this and do that. We have uh, an innovative solution. Well, Nature Sunshine has actually put our program to the test. Through clinical scrutiny, the Hughes Center for Research and Innovation is a great place. We have validation. We have scientific evidence of our products. This is a great thing that Nature Sunshine has done. And so if you look, Nature Sunshine's research center has conducted an independently reviewed clinical study to show just how our INFORM program is revolutionary. So 
that we'll move on and see what those results, how astonishing they really are. Now, here is a friend of ours, and uh, I'm just going to have you take a look here. And so what she did during a 90-day period, this is what how her numbers changed. So her uh, metabolic age reversed 21 years. She was down, you can see the picture of her on the right, and then you see the latest picture at this time of printing. And she had lost 60 pounds, and her cholesterol points were down 37 points. So in that 90-day period, there were individuals that with key biomarkers that had metabolic health already within the normal range, they were monitored for improvement. Even both groups followed diet and exercise recommendations, but only the second group received added benefit and they because they used the Inform product protocol. So you see what she did here. Is that a benefit? How many people do you know in your circle of influence would like to have those results? But let's look at the other measurable success stories here on the same slide. Uh, 15 over 10 reduction of blood pressure. So 11 percent reduction in the systolic and 12 percent in the diastolic. 18 percent reduction in the total cholesterol. 19 in the bad cholesterol. 12 percent in body weight reduction. 21.5 percent reduction of fat, fat mass and then 51% reduction in triglycerides. So a lot of people will tell you that they've really made changes in their life and they're moving forward and they eat really healthy. If they have a blood test done, the triglyceride number is going to tell you how junky your diet is. If it's above 150, I don't care what we say, we're still getting too much junk. So some people will have results without having the blood test, but the great thing, you have the clinical study, the scientific study, and now we have clinical proof. So let's look at what brought greater results on the next slide. So the participants experienced greater results with the informed supplements than just diet alone. So when people come to you as a coach, whether you're doing you know, classes, workshops, one-on-one, -on -one, you know, however you're setting your business up, know that if we don't encourage them to do the products, we're really doing them a disservice. We are, we are not doing them a favor. We're spending their time and, and my time or your time. But when they bring those supplements, this is what happens. 56% more weight loss at the end of 90 days. 65% more fat loss. 120% greater reduction on the top number of the blood pressure and 62% more on the diastolic. 66% greater reduction in that triglyceride number that we talked about. 129% greater redu reduction in the total cholesterol. 80% greater reduction in the bad cholesterol. You know, and if you ask people, is that worth it to you? So let's just scoot on and we'll see a couple of other uh, success stories. So if you'll take a look, let's look at Shane and Sharice. So Shane, and this is in his 90 days, so he's 7.5% fat loss. His metabolic age went down by 28 years. Sharice is 3.8% fat loss and her metabolic age is down by 15 years. So INFORM is completely different than anything else on the market, and we have the proof to back it up. People might lose weight. They may lose pounds, and, they're, and they've never been on a biotracker. So they get on a biotracker, maybe they've lost 28 pounds, but their metabolic age might be 90. So what we have to offer is a completeness, so a so people can get rid of that this e So you can see the uh, competitive advantage. So when compared to published studies with brand names, this is proven, 
The INFORM program outperformed every one of them in key biomarker indicators. For instance, the weight loss, 44% up to 123% better weight loss. Fat loss, 15% up to 233% fat loss. Greater improvement in the triglycerides and the total cholesterol and even the bad cholesterol, greater. So now we're, we're going to get kind of to the gut of, of uh, the situation. Let's move here. How does our gut go from healthy to toxic? You know, probably one bite at a time, we could say. But we're going to take a look at some of the things. Let's, this is a Western diet. You know, I did a study a long time ago and found out that children that eat three hot dogs a week had a seven times greater uh, risk of leukemia, and that was in a documentary. And so think about uh, the Western diets. What am I putting in there? And you know, we're going to eat things that we probably shouldn't from time to time, but let me ask you this. Can your microbiome handle it? So do microbiome. In our group, I even have people say it. I'll say, now we're going to say microbiome, because it's a word that we haven't heard a lot of in, until recent years. And so what we want to know is we want to get it to where we understand it. And so Western diet is one of the reasons that our microbiome and our gut health is getting worse. Another one, what about stress? Stress factor, really, when we are when we have more stress, now when I talk about stress, this slide will tell us, uh, the stress slide, when I talk about stress, let's just say stress is, is uh, something that we all are going to experience. But guess what? A chair was made for stress. The problem is if we put more in that chair than what it was designed for, it's going to break. So when I put more stress on myself, we're going to have something going on. So we've, so we've got Western diets, we've got stress, and now then our next slide, what about our environmental pollutants? Okay, gas fumes, hairspray. Uh, you know, every day there's a paper that's called uh, 30 Ways to Poison Yourself Before Breakfast, and it happens. It happens. So depending on what my environmental pollutants are, instead of me saying, and people that will come to you, they're going to say, well, you know, I work around chemicals, so it's, I'm just doomed. I'm just you know, going to have that problem. Baloney. So if they work around those chemicals, we have the opportunity to educate. We have the product that we need to build that microbiome up so now the gut health can reject that environmental pollutants. So let's look at the next slide, and we're going to get an up-close and personal look at the gut. So emerging science is showing the gut itself is a small ecosystem. Now think about that, ecosystem or microbiome. And, um, that's both harder and more important to keep healthy than what you might think. Modern diets, stress, environmental factors can easily trigger poor metabolic function. And when that happens, it can wreck a lot of our health, and we didn't really associate it with the microbiome because we didn't know it. We didn't know we just ate like our parents ate, and if they had diabetes, we thought we're going to have diabetes. And if they had heart disease, we think that we're going to have heart disease. One of the things that the informed education is going to teach and does teach us is genetics are only one part of the equation. So we say genetics load the gun, but lifestyle pulls the trigger. So you have the opportunity to give help and help to people. People are coming to you, they never heard that before. They didn't hear the hope of reversing what you have experienced in your genetics. So let's take a look at 
how this works, the next slide will show us. We're going to take a look at gut health. So the microbiome, and you'll see as it comes up, um, all of these things that are circling around the gut. The gut tells every one of those things what to do. So I'm going to just challenge all of you that are on here. Neurological, is that where maybe the stress syndrome is happening in my body? My central nervous system houses uh, the brain and, and the nerves start from that point, come down the spine, go out and tell everything what to do. What to do. If I recognize that what I put into my body is going to affect things that are challenges for my neurological system, would I think twice before I just gorged myself? Now, then let's look right on up at respiratory. What about the lungs, the bronchioles, the sinuses? I don't know about your area, but we have a challenge with that going on right now, and there are people that have fatigue and respiratory trouble all the time. Huh, did they know that it is associated with the gut microbiome? Do you know that the Greek word for sinus is sewer? So the Greek word understood that if I have a sinus problem, then guess what? I have a sewer problem. So my sewer brings me back to the gut. Let's talk about thyroid, adrenal glands, pancreas, the glands. What do glands do? Okay, so we go to the doctor to be diagnosed with something. What if I recognized ahead of time, if I got my gut healthier, that when I went to my doctor, that diagnosis was going to be better than what it was the last time? Or perhaps my diagnosis, and I'll give you one. It's been years ago, but uh, when I had a physical, they went through everything, and um, so they said the, the best advice we could give you is be sure and wear your seatbelt more because the question was, do you wear your seatbelt? And at that time, I really wasn't doing that like I needed to, and so we laughed about it. That's, that's a pretty good diagnosis from the doctor is wear your seatbelt. So let's scoot on over to weight. So you're, we're just going around the circle here. Yes, weight is an issue. Yes, people come to you for weight loss. Yes, but there is a reason. And a lot of people get turned off. They don't want to talk about weight loss. But would they want to talk about high blood pressure? Would they want to talk about getting uh, rid of the risk of heart disease, heart attack? What about people that have eczema? They have issues on the skin, they might have uh, acne, they may have eczema, those, are, those kind of things. What if they recognize you have the tool to help them with their skin by changing the microbiome? The immune system, 60 to 80 percent, depending on the studies you read, of your immune system is in your gut. What about blood sugar? That's bringing us back. Do you crave carbs? If you do, you do not have enough microbiome and not enough chromium in the body. Hormonal changes. The hormones operate, actually, hormones are, all that means is it is a messenger. So a hormone, the brain produces a message. It gives it to the central nervous system, crosses from the brain out into the glands, and the hormones carry the message. Well, if my gut is my second brain, and my second brain is sticky and ooey and gooey and stinks, then is it any wonder that my hormones are going to be stinky also? Then we come to the cardiovascular. This is another place that really this whole program will shine tremendously. So let's just look at the next slide to see about good bacteria. So we want to assist the proper function uh, because that good bacteria in there is going to help our metabolism, our heart, bones, brain, and the rest of our body. Now, bad bacteria, and if you notice, it's green and red. So you, if you look on that slide, you're going to see we have some of both. Every person that breathes will have some good and have some bad. If we were taught 30, well, I've been doing this almost 40 years, 
40 years ago we were taught if we have enough good in there, don't worry about the bad. It takes care of it. But let's just see what the bad does. It produces toxins. And they have a disastrous impact on all those systems that we just talked about. So now then as we move forward, let's just take a look at the recent study that we're talking about. It's, it is a revolutionary breakthrough. So now let's take a look here. On the left, you can see these are twins. Would you think that they were twins? You might look right at the face, you would, but as far as the body structure, well, a recent study, what happened was they took the gut microbes from four sets of human twins, one overweight and the other one slim. And they wanted to show that the key difference was that they had different balance in the biome of their gut. So what would they do? They introduced those same microbes of each twin into different groups of mice. And look what happened to the mice. They saw that the overweight humans microbes resulted in overweight mice. And they were all fed the same diet. So if you're wondering, maybe so-and-so, my, you know, Susie went on a diet, lost 12 pounds. I did what she did, and I gained three. What's the difference? Let's move right on, and you're going to find out what the difference is. So how does the INFORM program work? The INFORM program offers a path to healthy metabolic age, your metabolism. How is your gas running in your car? Are you getting good mileage from oil change to oil change or not? If you're not, is there another problem? So the INFORM program is offering us a healthy way uh, to metabolic age and function by supporting healthy body composition, weight management, and cardiovascular function, all in one easy-to-follow program. So that includes the metabolic age support, the products. Okay. It, in, it also includes the INFORM meal plan, an ex exercise plan, an education and coach support. Everything wrapped up into one. You're the coach. You've got the answers. The world is waiting to hear what you can teach them, what we can go out into the world, and this is how we're going to do it. The next slide says, the INFORM program is here to help to restore. We're going to restore that balance and how. Number one tells us because we're going to reset. We've got to reset, get rid of the bad, eliminate the toxic, get rid of the bacteria, and start clearing the way for the good. So we're resetting. So I'm going to ask all of us on here, what am I doing on purpose to reset? What am I doing on purpose to get rid of the bad? Now, I have to say this. If I am a coach and I am not doing this program, my question, how can I ever expect to help somebody else get there? Now, that's just me saying it. I have to do it, and it works. And guess what? I want to live. I want to live. I want to live until I die, and then I'm going to live again. So first of all is to reset. Number two is to repair. Building up the good with a targeted focus on gut health, restoring balance, and starting to support those core metabolic functions. You saw them. You saw them, and they're also in your coach's manual. They're in the participant's manual when you saw the gut, and you saw all of the different systems, how it is nourished or it's trashed by what's going on. So two is repair, and number three is now then we've cleared it, we've re we're repairing it, and now let's replenish it by maintaining healthy balance and promoting Optimal metabolic function by maintaining gut health. You know, remember, it's, it's what kind of gas we're putting in our car. So uh, you want to be sure that you get to where you're going. And the next slide will tell us what this program is going to do for us. When we use it as a complete system, 
combined with a recommended healthy diet and exercise plan, this is what the INFORM program does for us. It supports gut health to get rid of endotoxins, which can interfere, interfere with the gut performance. It helps support repopulation of the beneficial bacteria. It may reduce the risk of heart disease, and it helps promote muscle recovery, enhances the buildup of lean muscle mass, and you have the biotrackers that you can monitor this. It encourages healthy body composition when combined with exercise and a healthy diet. So let's start moving more. How much am I moving on purpose? Did I move 10 minutes more today? And when people first start, they think, oh, I can't walk four miles a day. Of course they can't. But can they do 10 minutes more than what they did yesterday? This program also modulates the oxidation of the LDL cholesterol. And it supports the healthy, it support, supports the healthy triglyceride levels. And uh, we talked about that. And the other thing I want to mention to you is uh, not only the triglyceride levels, but the modulation of the cholesterol happens with the liver's help at night. That's why in this kit, and we'll talk about that here in just a moment, but that's why we have that, uh, and that's why we have the cardio kit in there. It maintains healthy blood pressure. It supports a positive move, a mood, and it helps healthy insulin response. So let's just move on now. The next slide says a simple way to measure poor metabolic function. So, and we've talked about what metabolic age is associated with how effectively our metabolic, our meta metabolism is functioning. It should be similar to our biological age or ideally would be lower. The INFORM program is clinically studied to help reverse that. The biotracker, we've talked about that, and the biotracker identifies your weight, sure, but also body fat, hydration, lean muscle mass, bone mass, metabolic age and other key biomarkers. So we'll just take a look and you'll see the biotracker here on your next slide. So in that biotracker, get over the weight thing. And you can encourage people. That's why we say, what's your metabolic age? It helps to change their thinking. All they ever knew that a scale was, was to tell you how many pounds. So the next slide says, what is your metabolic age? The informed biotracker lets you know that. And the, the uh, biotracker, I will tell you, uh, the lady that is, uh, her, her metabolic age when she started was 84, she's 61, one in our group, and now her metabolic age is 34. So that is an encouragement. Now this slide tells us the best part of all with the coach. You are the coach. The people do not feel all alone. They're, they don't have to do it by themselves. So it creates and it helps you to create and help others maintain their goals. They might not have even ever set a goal before. But it lets them see that you are their certified informed coach and you will have a great group for them. The next time lets us take a look at what's going on, the next slide, uh, what's going on in the world. There's never been a more urgent time to take a stand for your own health and your own wellness. There's never been a greater need for a revolution. Think about your own health. And you might be overweight and you might think, well, I can't do that. How would that, you know, how would I do that? I'm overweight. Join the team. Get in there. Get on the program. So now let's just scoot on now a couple of slides, and we're going to go over how the, the very first meeting that you have or session, let's just talk about getting started and the program overview. Uh, the, we'll look at that, page one in your manual. So we've already discussed, and now then what I said earlier, 
uh, I gave you enough information that you can explain that. Go back and listen to this again. You can explain that and tie every one of these things going on with what the people sitting in your group, what they're there for. They're here for help. You know, they are here. They heard you help so and so, and so and so told them. So they have confidence already. They came for a plan. So now let's scoot on to the plan, the meal plan. More nutrient dense foods. Choose quality foods, whole foods. You don't have to count calories, but you count servings. Three meals with protein, two snacks with protein each day. The next one divides it out. The next slide will show us. And it even tells you, and this is in your book, it tells you what serving sizes are. It lets you see when do I eat and what do I eat and how I can, what my serving size is, how much water I need to be drinking, half of my body weight in ounces up to 100 ounces. I want you to notice the oils and fats, five. So many people today are heavy because they went on the no-fat diet. Their brain couldn't think, their hormone, hormones could not function, and now they're overweight and they have knee replacements. Oils and fats are very important. It's in the kit. It's in your diet. You're getting omega-3s in the evening kit. We have, some, we have one guy that what he did was he said, okay, I've just started drinking five shots of olive oil a day. I figured that's one way I can get in there. So you know what? Whatever you need to do to get going, get a jump start, and probably not very many people are going to drink olive oil. So let's move on. When you're teaching people about proteins, they're going to say, well, what are proteins? A lot of people don't even know what a protein food is. This lets you see what it is. Salmon, chicken, almonds, but guess what? Your support shakes. People say, how do I eat out? What am I going to do? You drink a shake before you go because it changes by the time. It takes 20 minutes to get the message from your gut up to your brain to tell you you're satisfied. You drink your shake, then you go out to eat, and you're already satisfied, so you're going to choose better foods. Let people know that the metabolic support shakes those are protein. They can do them for snacks. They can do them for meals. They can add something to them. Put their spinach in there. In our group, we put spinach in the, uh, let's just say, in the pea protein metabolic support shake, and we put spinach in it, and we'll put uh, some cacao or Hershey's cocoa. Put it in there, and they got their spinach. They didn't even know it. So the next one is vegetables, six servings of vegetables. Half a cup cooked or finely chopped, one cup of large or loosely packed. This gives you some examples. Asparagus, cauliflower, snap peas, zucchini. There are ways to prepare those. Put them on a baking sheet, drizzle olive oil, sea salt, garlic. Put them in your oven for 450 degrees for 15 minutes. You bring it out. It's crispy. It's good. You're getting oils you're getting vegetables. Then what about fresh greens? It says five ounces a day. Did you know that a wedge of romaine with the end on it is about five ounces? So you can just chop that end off of it. You can make a salad out of that. You can just start chomping on it, eat it however you want to. This gives us some examples. Uh, the spinach, romaine, the uh, spring mix, argula uh, lettuce, uh, all of those things are very beneficial. Now fruit. People say, what are fruits? How much do I eat? You want to avoid dried foods, fruits because they're very high in sugar. One small apple, half a cup of blackberries, one kiwi, two small plums. Legumes are optional. What we do is, if you want to, I say, if you want to uh, enhance your weight loss, then I would limit or eliminate the legumes. I would I also encourage eliminating dairy for some people. That's just my preference. That it, you know, it already shows you how much dairy to eat and you'll do fine. Greek yogurt is a great uh, example. But the, if people say, what's a legume? You, you've got the information. These are good. Black beans, chickpeas, lentils. Dairy, that's optional. You see, that's why some people have a conviction they don't want to do it. 
so they can do an, al uh, an alternative, which is almond milk. And no, it's not a dairy. It didn't come from a cow. It came from an almond. But they can do Greek yogurt. These are better choices than what they've ever known. The oils and fats, avocado, that's a great food. It's a fat food, coconut oil, olive oil. We've got our super omegas in the kit. You can add uh, flaxseed oil. Those are things that you can do. And we talked about water, half of your body weight in ounces. And herbal teas, you can count in that. Coffee and tea, you're going to have to limit that because it dehydrates. And you want to hydrate those cells. So let's take a look at the tips for success. Choose whole foods, whole foods, instead of the pre-processed. As often as you can, make sure they're organic, free range, wild caught. Your breakfast should always contain a quality protein every day. We need 30 grams, an egg is seven, one serving of our pea protein or the whey or the soy is 20 grams. You can, you can be uh, creative. You can put you can do that. Take a handful of nuts. You can put nuts in your shake put nut butter. You can do things to uh, change it up so you won't get tired of the same thing. And then we have the exercise plan. Aim for at least 5,000 steps a day. If you're doing more than that, more power to you, that's great. Most people that come into this program, they haven't been moving much. So just help them. Start to say, you know, start them working 10 minutes more a day. Work it up to 30 minutes. You know, 30 minutes a day is about 5,000 steps. Tracking their results. Exercise at least five days a week at a moderate intensity level. And use a tracking tool like a Fitbit or pedometer. Now, let's just talk about the product products in the uh, program. Remember, reset, repair, and replenish. How are we going to do that? We've already talked about the meal replacement. Uh, we've talked about how the, they contain 20 grams. They're going to promote muscle. Guess what? Muscle, lean muscle mass. Get rid of fat, gain muscle. The cardio kit, what does it do? Circulatory function. It helps to modulate the cholesterol levels. Levels omega-3 uh, that without that reduces, uh, I mean, bad LDL, um, causes, is caused because of bad fats. The levels of the omega-3s that may reduce a coronary heart disease is in your, in your uh, cardio kit that you take at night. You're also getting antioxidant. In your book, in your chapter, I think it's chapter 5, it shows you rest on a vehicle. Same deal, the arteries start resting. And if you don't put in the oils and the nutrient-dense food, then you're either going to have a hole that you're going to have to repair or you're going to put flexibility in there and the arteries start to repair on their own. One of the very keys that I love to talk about is this next one is the berberine. We have people right and left that are getting off of metformin. That's me saying it. That's not Nature Sunshine saying it. Uh, we have one of our ladies on our Monday evening classes, she is off of four insulin shots a day and off of um, metformin due to the cardio and the metabolic age system kit. So the berberine supports the healthy glucose metabolism, supports gut health to combat the toxins. Then the next one is the probiotics. This is a blend of 11 strains of good bacteria. People talk about friendly flora. When you put the probiotic together with the berberine, one, three times a day is what I do. When you do that, that gets that started to get the, to get the microbiome in the gut to rebuild that so the friendly flora can take over and replenishes that friendly bacteria in the gut. So I talked a little fast here. I thank you all for your time. I hope the things that I've said will be a help to you. I dare you. I dare you to dream. 
I dare you to reach out for that dream and I dare you to get on the whole program and let me know what happened to you in the next 90 days. So, uh, Terry, I'll just turn it back to you here. Awesome. Ms. Dale, thank you very much. It's a, it's a very good always to hear you on a call and a webinar, and, and you went through the whole program thoroughly there. So thank you very much. It was great great to hear from you. You're welcome. Okay, you hold on the line here. We've got some good things to come through already. There's been some, uh, some good questions as we move forward here. I want to make sure we get a few questions answered, but I've actually got a testimonial that kind of echoes what you just said. Uh, this young lady okay. here says that my that my uh, my husband is off of all his diabetes medications and is maintaining <laughs> his numbers hum, his numbers with the diet and exercise. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome to hear. That is awesome. Woohoo! That is fantastic. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's great. great. That's great. Yep. Now here's a question here about about the berberine. Uh, what is the yep. maximum amount of berberine uh, taken per day? You know, I'm going to tell you this. Um, so it recommends one three times a day, and so now if you if your if your blood sugar happens to be down in the tank, you know you mm -hmm. you have low blood pre, uh, blood sugar all the time, uh, then you may not need the three. If you have low blood sugar because you had high blood sugar and now it's crashed, then you may do very well putting the berberine with the probiotic together with food. And you may do very well without it, uh, you know, crashing the blood sugar. One lady uh, is taking one three times a day plus the detox basics at night. And the detox basics has three. So she's doing that would equal six a day. Now, if a person's blood sugar is 72, they're not going to take six berberine. Okay? We're going to use our head. Okay. Right. I uh, had one lady, one of my customers, and she said, you know what, she's diabetic, and she said, I'm taking 11 berberine a day. I said, you've got to be kidding me. She said, I didn't ask you, you didn't tell me, you didn't tell me to do it, I'm going to get off of this medicine. <laughs> so <laughs> anyway, I talked, I called Dr. Tripp, and I said, hey, what am I going to do with this lady? Anyway, and so, and I was encouraged, he did not recommend that at all, you know, but it wasn't going to hurt her. So there you go. And she's getting off of her medicine, so what can I say? That that's helps. awesome. That is so amazing there. And that's another testimonial of helping somebody out with just the products. That's great. That's right. really good. Okay, now some, some people have a, a question here. Uh, they say, uh, how can I help somebody, a person who may need to gain some weight? Weight, weight loss isn't their issue, but perfect. weight gain is to be appropriate. Yeah. All right, perfect. The very same things. So the meal replacements. Uh, they have inulin, they have phytosterols. That is going to exchange for the wrong cholesterol. So putting that in is going to be really important. And keep in mind, when we balance that, I've got one customer had heart, uh, open heart surgery. He is probably 40 pounds uh, smaller than he should be. And he has gained 13 pounds. And he's doing mm -hmm. the very same thing. So he wasn't eating properly in the first place. He didn't eat protein first thing in the morning. And it will not hurt a person to bring a shake and a meal. If they can bring a meal and then have a shake right along with that if they need to gain weight. Oh, that's interesting. I like that. That's very good, very good. Okay, and one other one here. It looks like there's someone uh, maybe questioning, just so curious about the cardio kit. What were you saying about the beneficial functions of the cardio kit to being taken at night? Okay, uh, Dr. Tripp has taught us that when we sleep, that's when cholesterol is made. And, and I'm just going to say that's the way I took it. I won't quote him. But mm. what, in my studies, cholesterol is made at night. So, and the liver is needing support to modulate. It mod, is modulated at night. So what that means is to modulate it, that means I take it where it needs to go. So the Cardiox LDL is in the cardio kit. Your Super Omegas is in the cardio kit. And that Super Supplemental, you've got two of them. And instead of thinking of energy and vitamins, think of antioxidants. While you sleep, you are primering and repainting your car. Mm. You're not letting the free radicals land on your arteries. So it's protection for the arteries. Oh, that's awesome. That is so awesome. That's great. 
man, uh, Dale, you, I think you got this thing nailed down. I think you got it. Well, you know, I should have <laughs> learned something in, in almost 40 years, don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Uh, thank you very much again for being on. We'll, we'll kind of end our questions there, but I tell you, I've learned a lot. It's been good, and hopefully you guys here on the call and webinar have been learning some yourself. Take note, and if nothing else, you think of new ways or new ideas you can approach people that you're working with as far as your clients go and moving forward. So, again, thanks, guys, for being on. Ms. Uh, Dale, Scott, thanks for being here as well. Let me go through a, a few pleasure. more things here. Great, great. Uh, as you start a group with five or more people in, in, the, in the month of February, we will give you $50 in product credit plus a five, five in-form shaker cup. So this is kind of our promo for the month of February. We're wrapping it up here, so we're going to give you this last little tidbit. And, of course, there's, there's goals for starting up and prizes and, and a total product credit that we can give you. $50 in product credit, and then $100 in product credit as you increase that, and then $100 more in product credit. So you can really just gain lots of product credit as you create your groups and, and creating more volume within the group. So this is all available for you on the website. Feel free to review that. But always think about starting a group as, as quickly as possible. We'd love to have you creating groups and moving them forward. Uh, we did have a, a Fitbit drawing winner for the month of January, and that is Miss Nisi Reek, and she uh, got a Fitbit there. Hopefully, sent out to her here real Yay. quick. Uh, but that's an awesome thing. It's a good way to track things and and keep the steps moving. That's always fun. Uh, that's an awesome thing. And uh, even for now, we have our challenge begins. It's anytime you want, really. Just start the challenge. Get involved with it. No registration period or sign up. Uh, just, just begin really anytime. 13 weeks of a a healthy transformation is what we were looking for. Prizes. We're going to give out quarterly. And there's lots of fun stuff there. The coaches get to win, too. So as participants win in your group, uh, the coaches begin to win as well. Uh, we, we do want you to have an NSP account, though. So hopefully be a, a part of the family and, and be a member of NSP. Feel free to check all that out there on naturesunshine.com uh, slash challenge. And you got some good information there. You can read about and, and look on there and pass to your groups. Uh, the informed challenge participants from the last quarter won some pretty good prizes. They got... Uh, First place prize there of a thousand bucks cash. That's pretty good. And the coach receives five hundred dollars cash. So that's not a not a bad breakdown. Then there's second place prize and third place prizes, all winning some cash and photo shoots and convention travel and all kinds of fun things. So a lot of things that are happening right there as you're part of the Inform Challenge. Here's some of our, our last first place winner there from uh, Illinois, Miss Robin Lang. Uh, she got her before and after photos there. Some good things. Uh, lost 28 pounds and lowered her metabolic age by 25 years. That's that's pretty awesome. Um, that's really cool to see how that transformation happens in the first place winner. And then our second place winner, Miss Kimberly uh, Popel, Popelman, I can't say her last name there very well, Ohio. She had a great change there, lost 25 pounds and lowered her metabolic age by 20, 20 years. And this is her comment. She says, very awesome. Thanks to Inform, I know I can maintain this new lifestyle for a lifetime. And that's what we're looking at, is having people change their lifestyle for their entire life. That's, that's a really good thing there. Our third place winner here is a Victoria Davis. She's from Ohio as well, lost 16.4 pounds, and lowered her metabolic age by uh, 14 years. That's very awesome. She says, I am a very goal-driven, uh, very goal-driven, and once I set my mind to do something, I get it done. That's a, that's a very ambitious person. I love it. And uh, Victoria did very well winning third place there. So. Uh, people are winning. People are having great success, and we encourage you to do the same. Keep moving forward, and, and lots of good things there. We'll actually have an inform into action meeting at convention. So hopefully, many of you are planning to go to a convention there in Orlando. Uh, that'll be a fun time, free to all for all to attend. Um, the different breakdowns are there from seven to ten, and ten thirty to one thirty, and then again from two o'clock to five o'clock p.m. Uh, the space is limited for this. We're only going to get twenty-five people per session. Uh, but feel free to call the call center there or here and, and reach out and get registered for that. It's a good thing. It's more more training upon training so you can know what to do uh, more effectively as a coach. So some really fun things that are happening. So I'm excited. This is all, all kind of fun stuff, getting people healthy and, and moving forward with their lives. And our, our next webinar will be next Tuesday, or at least Tuesday, March 7th. It will be a couple of Tuesdays from now. Uh, but we're excited to be a part of that, and hopefully you guys will, will see you there too. So. Again, thanks for being on this webinar, guys. It's been a great time, and have a great, great Tuesday and the rest of the week. Talk to you soon. Thanks again. Thank you.
Thanks. Thanks, Thanks everyone. Take care. Bye. Bye-bye.